Well, hello there, pluggers. I've a from Gear again with you. Thanks indeed for joining me for another guitar lesson. This is a great number from Phil Collins called uh, Another Day in Paradise. Okay, I'm in standard tuning, uh, but I do have a capo on the third fret. Okay, this is for my own voice range. <laughs> yes, voice, another question mark. Um, but uh, I find uh, if I try and do it in the, the key that um, Phil Collins normally uses it's way too high for me um, so if you want to play along with Phil Collins please raise the capo to a fifth or sixth fret depending on which version you're you're playing against okay some of his versions are in uh, one key and some are in a slightly lower key so fifth or sixth fret with a capo should bring you in tune with one of them okay if you want to play along with him um, I'm going to play uh, the intro a couple of verses uh, the chorus and the middle section or the bridge section um, and then uh, break it down and show exactly how I played it okay and then you'll have everything you need to play the rest of the song okay so here we go <laughs> to whistle as he crosses the streets, right? He's embarrassed to be there. Oh, think twice. Just another day for you and me in paradise. Oh, think twice. It's just another day for you. So there you have it. Um, a bit loose, but <laughs> you get the gist, don't you? <laughs> okay. Okay. So uh, the introduction. Basically, I'm playing a um, uh, relative to the capo. I'm playing a B minor seventh. Okay. It's two frets up from the capo. Minor bar chord. Um, don't worry about the sixth string. I'm only playing the fifth string downwards, as you can see. Um, and I'm playing a B minor seventh. So take the pinky off. Okay, because you need the pinky <laughs> for something else. <laughs> okay, so basically you so you do da, da, and then you add pinky to the fifth fret from on the second string from the capo. Okay, so it's and then off. Okay, so it's two without da, da, then on and then off. Okay, so da, 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 da. Okay, then change to an A chord and uh, strum it down to the second string, sort of, from the fifth down to the second. Then take the pinky off or whichever finger you're using on the second string. So open second string, then the second fret of the third string, okay? And then play an E minor seventh. Okay, and I'm just using a single finger on the second fret of the fifth string. Okay, and I'm just hitting that sixth and fifth string, and then picking basically the first, second, and third strings really. Okay, so the whole thing is. There is a slight, but you can 
you can jiggle around as much as you like. You can, whatever you, you know, if you find something you prefer, then, but that's just an idea for you, okay? So, B minor seventh, strum, added pinky to the fifth fret of the second string, of A, open second string, third string, second fret, and then E minor, strum up, first, second, third string, so, Once more slowly for you. Twice. Got it? Okay, so it does that about four times as an intro. And then it comes into the verse, okay? And the verse is a bit simpler because there's, there's no real... Uh, you know, you don't need to use a pinky or anything, you just strum the chords, okay? And the chords are basically um, she calls out B minor seventh, the same one you started with. She calls out to the A man in the E minor seventh, eight. all right? B minor seventh, so can you A help me? And what I do, I mean, if you want to fancy that up, uh, you can go. That instead of strumming it, but other than that, so you can do it two ways. You can have go, she calls out to the man on the street, so can you help me? Just play the just strum it on the A, okay? Or you can go, she calls out to the man on the street, so can you help me? And all I'm playing there is basically arpeggiated A chord down from five, okay. But it's a, it's a suspended fourth A, okay, with pinky on the third fret up from the capo on the second string, okay. So, it's and then down to the second fret with the uh, pinky on, on the second string, and then open second string, and then the second on the third again. So. So, got that? Okay, but it's up to you. You can just strum it if you want. So that's the two ways. I'll just demonstrate that again. She calls out to the man on the street. So can you help me? All right. Or you can do. So that's two ways you can do that, okay? And then it repeats again, goes into the B minor seven. It's called an A to E minor seven. Let's sleep. B minor seven. No one to tell me A. Okay? Then it goes back into the second verse, which is exactly the same as the first one with different words, obviously. It goes, he walks on. B minor seven to A to E minor seven. B minor seven. Chance not to hear A. B minor seventh, he starts to whistle, and the A crosses the E minor seventh. B minor seventh, he's embarrassed to A B there. Okay, so we'll just go through the two verses uh, all in one hit. Okay, so here we go. Comes out of the introduction. I'll just do one of the introductions. Okay, so last one. She calls out to the man. So the first verse I used, the, you notice I used the, and the second verse I used just the A strumming, okay? And then it goes into the uh, the next bit, which is, oh, think twice, okay? And it goes, um, oh, 
goes to B minor. I'm not playing the seventh this time, I'm playing the full B minor with the whole fingers, okay? So pinky is now on again, okay? B minor, straight for B minor, not the seventh, okay? Oh, to A, think twice. Just a G, another day for you and me in A. Paradise, okay, so got that again, B minor. Oh, to A, think twice. Just a G, another day for you and me. Back to A, paradise, B minor again. Oh, back to A, think twice. To G, this is another day for you and me. Da, 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 da. Now that bit, so it's the same again, it goes, oh, second part of it is O, oh, think to A, to B minus to A, twice. Just a G, another day for you and then I play me in paradise. Okay, so that bit is basically um, A, me, uh, me, and a. So it's a, a lazy A, I'm just barring the first four strings on the second fret and hit it. Make sure you leave the fifth string uh, open, okay? And then you go, then put your third finger on the fourth fret up from the capo on the fourth string. Back to, an, uh, to the first shape again, just the ordinary lazy A. And then the D chord, and then back to the intro. Okay, so I'll go through that whole um, chorusy bit again, okay? so. Oh, B minor, think A twice. Just a G, another day for you and me. And back to A, paradise. A, B minor. Oh, back to A, think twice. Just another day for you and me in paradise. Okay, so I'm just going to play that through very slowly for you, okay? Okay, so let's, uh, it does that, then it comes out into that, um, well the version I'm playing anyway, it comes out of uh, having done the chorus, it does a couple of intros, and it goes, just think about it, and that sort of thing, no, and it goes into the bridge section, right, which is the uh, oh lord bit, uh, is there some, nothing nobody can do or something, okay, so then it goes into an A, right, So it goes A, then B minor, Lord. Is that back to A? Nothing nor anybody D can do. Back to A, oh, oh, B minor, Lord. There must be A, something you can say. Da 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 da. This next verse, okay. So we'll just go through that again, that middle uh, bridgey section. So I'll come out of, I'll do the chorus and then go into it. I think that's probably the best thing I can do, okay. Um, so it goes, um, oh, think twice, it's just another day in paradise. into the following verses okay and that's it you've got all the bits now you need to play the song okay 
So uh, listen to the various versions and uh, you'll be able to play any uh, any version you like from that, I hope. <laughs> anyway, thanks for watching and listening and I'll see you in the next lesson.